My name is Bernd Stahl. I'm from De Montfort University, which is in Leicester in the UK. Um, and I do research around ethics and information technology, traditionally. Um, in the last few years, I've done various projects for the European Commission, including one which looks at responsible research and in innovation in industry. And we look specifically at the question of how that uh, could be implemented in the area of ICT for aging. Business and industry can benefit from RI in a variety of ways. Uh, I think there, there, there are two main ones. One has to do with compliance. So a company that develops a technology that comes up with research may be subject to um, regulatory requirements. So they may, for example, uh, fall under medical directives, um, or medical devices directives. Uh, they may have to comply with um, data protection regulations. Uh, so there, there's a, a large variety of regulations out there that companies need to be aware of and uh, complying with that, visibly complying with that, is part of what Responsible Innovation, I think, does. On the other hand, um, I think Responsible Innovation can be beneficial for companies in that it sets them apart from their competitors. So it can be seen as an extension of their general corporate social responsibility and uh, applying that to their R&D uh, activities, so the research and development activities, and in that sense, um, showing that they're doing this responsibly may be something that uh, may please customers and that may generally um, show that they have a competitive advantage. Uh, the aging population in Europe and, and worldwide is one of the, the grand social challenges. So this is something that um, all Western societies face at the moment. We're all um, aging, the age profile gets higher. And one assumption is, or one hope is, that technology may help deal with those problems. So we will run into or we're likely to run into the problem that more and more old people have to be looked after uh, by less and less young people. And um, ICT, for example, may help to address that. So ICT may help overcome loneliness, uh, it may help uh, uh, monitor people's uh, usage of drugs, uh, of, of medical intervention. Um, so the idea is that this, this big social challenge that we have, namely that we get older, is something that we can deal with by using technology. If that's true, then the question is how can we do this, how can we develop those technologies in a way that are actually responsible and that means both the, the process of research and innovation, so how do we find out what the technologies are, but also, and I think that's even more important in this case, uh, look at what are likely consequences to be. So uh, the assumption for example that ICT may overcome loneliness may be true, but it may also lead to higher isolation, it may lead to less personal contact. And I think uh, Responsible Research and Innovation aims to highlight this sort of problem early on in the development phase to make sure that the technologies are then um, developed but also used in a way that tries to prevent those problems.